to the channel. It's your boy Jay, aka the Murder Whistle. As you can see, I got my co pilots here with me. Today, we're watching a movie that y'all been requesting for a minute. It was actually on a poll sometime last year, but um, it got beat. But um, today, we're watching Unforgiven. I don't know anything about Unforgiven other than the fact that. It got Cleese in with um, well, it got Clint Eastwood in it, and it's a western. I'm actually excited to watch it because y'all been hyping this up for six months or longer. It's been a minute. I'm really looking forward to getting to it. Before I do that, I'm gonna give a shout out to Jonathan Patrick. I want to tell you thank you for buying me this shirt. Um. For y'all that's not on Patreon, I watched Young Guns 1 and Young Guns 2 over there. One of my favorite lines from the whole um, series is, I'll make you famous, that Billy the Kid said. And John and Patrick got me a shirt that says that on there. I appreciate that greatly. My man actually come through. He he got me a lot of good, nice t-shirts. Um, all the dope Rocky ones y'all see me wear, those from him. So I appreciate that, big homie. Do me a favor. Like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to check us out on social media. Don't forget to check out that link to the Patreon. And you're going to have a word <laughs> what I watch on Fridays because there's a poll for it every week. Um, with that being said, I'm ready to get into it. So I'll see you on the other side. Let's get it. So is that William guy? Is that Clint Eastwood? So he's already a murderer and he lost his wife. So he about to be on that <laughs> Big whiskey one home. Damn it! Come around and laugh! I bet sex used to stink horrible back in the day. <laughs> Why is he cutting her up? I bet she said he had a little dick. Get off her, cowboy. I, I bet she said he had, he had a little dick. That's the only reason why somebody would be that mad in the middle of getting sex. Now when he said, who's is it? And she named somebody else. She didn't steal nothing. She didn't even touch his poke. All she done when she seen he had a teensy little pecker is give a giggle, that's all. What the f I tell you? Ain't no man gonna get that mad at a butt naked woman unless she say his dick a little. Step over to the office and get the whole whip. A whipping? That's all they get after what they've done? Whipping ain't no little thing, Alice. But what they've done, they can talk about more than. Shut up! Yeah, he said a bull whip. I've seen slave movies. But you figure nobody wanna fuck her now, right? Hell no. Hey, man, you know what? His dick got to be real little because he paid for it and she laughed. You ain't even going to whip him? Well, I find him instead, Alice. That ain't fair, Lil' Bill. That ain't fair. Lil' Bill kind of saw him, ain't he? Just because we let them smelly fools ride us like horses don't mean we got to let them brand us like horses. Maybe we ain't nothing but whores, but we, by God, we ain't horses. They treat horses better. At least from what I'm seeing. Hey, man, she said that dude's dick little. He cut her face up, bro. Hey, I'm telling you, hey, the male ego is fragile. You don't look like no rootin', tootin', son of a bitch and cold-blooded assassin. My guess is you're calling yourself Mr. William Money. The same one who shot Charlie Pepper up in Lake County. Boss! Hey, boss! Yeah, what's up, son? He say, son. Like I was saying, you don't look no meaner than hell, cold-blooded damn killer. 
Maybe I ain't. Hey, that's Clint Eastwood, boy. He got a main gruff. I'm a damn killer myself, except uh, I ain't killed as many as you because of my youth. Schofield Kid is what they call me. Everybody got to have a nickname. I'm gonna kill a couple of no good cowboys. For what? For cutting up a lady. They cut up her face. They cut her eyes out. They cut her ears off. Hell, they even cut her teeth. I mean, they did do a lot of cutting. I can't move those damn pigs. Damn, maybe the kids cussing? Hey, this movie will cuss more than I do. I ain't like that anymore, kid. So he's a killer that don't kill no more. Hey, she healed better than I thought she would have. Took you boys a while. A couple more days and uh, I was going to call on the sheriff. The river was all swollen up. We couldn't cross her. I bet. I'm surprised they actually brought him back. Hey, man, they scared the out of me, Sam. I brung for the lady, the one my partner caught. Hey, that's that's nice of him. She's the best of the lot. Better than the ones I gave him. Are they throwing mud or what are you doing? A pony? She ain't got no face left. You're gonna give her a goddamn mangy pony? She ain't mangy, man. Get out of here! I'd have took the horse. We can still hit him with rocks. I'd have took the horse. They talking like she looked like the Phantom of the Opera. When he was cut with that big ass knife, I thought I thought all oh, this was gonna be gone. Oh, he can't hit. <laughs> Throw a rock at it, see if you can hit it. The sights might be off. Do Pa used to kill folks? Yeah. They did. So if he's going on his trip, who's going to watch his kids? They didn't have daycare back then. Well, you take care of your sister now, my son. And you kill a few chickens if you have to, and keep those hogs that got the fever separate. If you have any problem, you go see Sally Two Trees at Ned Logan's. How old is this little boy? Shut the fuck up. Hey, my man Rusty is I'm not used to be able to cuss and whip a horse like this, but your ma, rest her soul, showed me the error of my ways. And she had to be a hell of a woman. And for a while, he leave this little boy in charge. How old is this little boy? Where'd you get that money? We ain't got any money. You told them cowboys you had. He was lying. What are you going to do when somebody comes to collect? You going to hump him? You're gonna hump him a thousand times? So how much do it cost for a night with a whore? Cause a thousand times? Well a thousand dollars is a dollar a lay. That just seems like it. They're paying a thousand dollars to whatever son of a bitch kills the two boys that cut up Delilah. And those cowboys are right out beefed down to Kansas and Cheyenne. They be telling everybody that. You sure those whores got all that money? Well, you know how women can lie. Knock them around a little bit, ask them where the money is. They ain't got none. But they could have squirreled away that much to five of them. Maybe. Hell, yeah, one of them had 240 by herself. That is a pretty scenery. Shut the f up! Will. They got Morgan Freeman in this bitch. Hey, Will. Come on in the house. I'd son. Hey, I'm telling you right now. You can put a picture of Morgan Freeman up in this movie, 
and Morgan Freeman today ain't changed. I bet you can find his high school picture ain't changed. We got Clint Eastwood, Lil Bill's Gene Hackman, right? And Morgan Freeman. All right, so what these fellas do? Cheated cards, steal some strays, spit on a rich fella, what? No, they cut up a woman, cut up her face, cut her eyes out, cut her fingers off, cut her tits. Everything but her cunning, I suppose. What'd he say? Well. Hey, that's the main look back he got. So you still have that Spencer rifle, huh? And I can still knock your eye out of a bird flying, too. <laughs> Hey, man, he can't keep following this whole movie, man. Man, I can't imagine driving a horse. I said driving. Riding a horse everywhere you had to go. She just ain't allowing that I changed. She don't realize I ain't like that no more. Well, you know, Will. He's the same, Ned. He's, he say that as he's gonna go kill somebody. Claudia, she straightened me up. Cleared me of drinking whiskey and all. Just because we're going on this killing, that don't mean I'm going to go back to being the way I was. So he was just a drunk killer. I'm just a fella now. I ain't no different hey. than anyone else. Clint Eastwood got one of the voices that, like, if he seriously got mad at you and yelled at you, it would be f***ing terrifying. You know, it's a savage country, really. That's the second one they shot in 20 years. Uh, it's uncivilized shooting persons of substance. That said no firearms. Why didn't he tell him what the sign said? The local ordinance obliges you to surrender all sidearms to the proper authorities for the duration of your visit. Well, I can assure you, young man, that neither my companion nor I carry firearms on our person. He just... We rely upon the goodwill of our fellow man and the forbearance of reptiles. Hey, he said, f*** your law. <laughs> your law, f*** your rules. I'm gonna do what I want. Where's little Bill for Christ's sake? Building his damn porch. Where is arm at? He's coming, man. Of course he's coming. Oh, bro, you can't go to war with us with one arm. Well, there's a dignity in royalty, a majesty. I'm just saying. This dude got a nickname that people know. Oh, I wouldn't point no pistol at nobody, sir. We can't be going fucking with him. Miss Bell Shop, I think a cup of tea. Oh, they might win. I know he about to say something stupid. Boys, this here's English Bob. Did you run out of Chinaman? Bill, Bill. Well, I thought you was, um, uh, well, I thought that you were dead. Well, actually, what I heard was that you fell off your horse, drunk, of course, and that you broke your bloody neck. I heard that one myself, Bob. Hell, I even thought I was dead. So they got old beef. Uh, I wouldn't do that if I were you. Shut the fuck up! You're not armed, are you, Bob? A uh, peacemaker? But that wouldn't worry you, would it? I'm afraid so, Bob. You don't like firearms, sir. Is it gonna be some Make sure you don't get wet. Hey, man, that's embarrassing, man. My man just standing there with pee on him. The duck of death. The uh, duke. Look, bro, after you pee on yourself, you can't correct me, dog. If I say duck, it's f***ing duck. You been talking about the queen again? On Independence Day? <laughs> Look, can he fight? <laughs> oh, s***. I guess you think I'm kicking you, Bob. <laughs> What I'm doing is this mm. Oh, I said little Bill was soft earlier. I'm sorry. I apologize. Bill got some crazy in him. Tell him there ain't no horse gold. Even if there was, oh, they wouldn't want to come looking for it. Uh. Anyhow. 
I mean, he kicked this out of him. He square danced on his ass. Go on, mind your own business. Little Bill said, I'm about that life. Hey, Peabody, you gonna pick your boy up out the mud? A man like me? Only one of a man like me could get his one he'd have to pay for. It. That ain't right, buying flesh. Claudia, rest your soul, would never want me doing something like that. Me being a father. Hey, man, he loved that woman. You, you just use your hand? I don't miss it all that much. What oh, about? They, they were shooting. Scared the shit out of them. We all. Who the f shoot them? Yeah. Shit. Did it hit you? No, I bumped my head falling off my horse. They're horrible f shot. Ain't shooting us no more. Shooting wheel wheel? You don't reckon we in somebody's field, do you? I didn't see nothing planted. Shooting at us again. What the f is they doing? Hey, kid, it's me, Will Money. What the hell is the kid shooting at us for? Is that you? Who in the hell you got with you, Will? It's Ned Logan, my old partner. Now, don't go shooting at us, you hear? We're going to collect our horses and come on over there. Why was he shooting at everything? No. No, I ain't. Can he not see? If he can't see, we got to take his gun ASAP. We never talk about no other fella. Well, there's two of them cowboys, isn't there? Better there's three of us in case they got friends. I figure I can take care of them two cowboys myself. Bro, you can't kill us. What the f are you talking about? Hell, you wasn't even coming close. Get your damn hands off my rifle, mister. Shoot him and let's be on the way. What, you going back with him? Well, he's my partner. You don't go, I don't go. What's it come to, three ways? Oh, he can't count. Hey, but for real, why was he shooting that way, that way, and that way if he said he was being followed? All my shots would have been that way, where they was. What the hell are you pissing on about? What? Well, what are you looking at, anyhow? Clouds, kid. Just looking at them clouds over yonder on the corner. We got a storm riding up our ass. Oh, this boy don't know nothing, do he? Oh, them. Hell, I seen them. <laughs> he can't see, can he? See that hawk up there? I could hit that hawk with one shot. Hell, I could hit it too, Ned. If I didn't mind wasting a shot. There ain't no hawk, kid. You can't see for shit, can you? He's blind, Will. I ain't blind, you asshole! Now hold on, hold it. How far can you see, kid? Fifty yards? I can see well enough to shoot this son of a bitch right here in front of me. Now hold on. Listen, I'll tell you what. I'll go stand 50 yards. If you hit me, I'll go home if you don't kill me. But if you miss, this will be your last ride, boy. That's twice you to try to pull a gun on me. Well, you actually pulled it on me this time. It won't be a third. I promise to your mother, it will not be a third. The Duke of Death. The Duke. Du du Duke of Death. Peabody, you can't correct me. I said Duck. That the events that are described in there are taken from the account of eyewitnesses, sir. Eyewitnesses? Yes, sir. You mean like the Duck himself, I guess? The Duke. Duck, I says. Exactly. First off, Corky never carried two guns. No, he, he, was, he was called Two Gun Parker. Yeah, well, a lot of folks did call him Two Gun. But that wasn't because he was sporting two pistols. That was because he had a dick that was so big, it was longer than the barrel of that Walker Colt that he carried. Hey, man. They said my man's dick was big enough, so they called him Two Guns. That is crazy. Now I'm wondering about how many cowboy names mean something like something different now. A business up in Jackson County. That really happened. I mean, the way they say it happened. Shut your blind ass up and go to bed. 
Say net. Don't talk to me, bitch. How many men you kill? <laughs> you keep playing with me. It's going to be one new one on the list. I promise he won't see the morning. It ain't so easy to shoot a man anyhow, you know, especially if some bitch is shooting back at you. Let me show you something. Just, just, just. Look here. Okay. I, I know, just take that. Oh, no. We're not playing this game. Well, there's the key. All you got to do is shoot me. And you and Bob can just ride on out of here free as birds. We're not playing this game. First, you got to cock it. Go on, cock it. Oh, you a new fool. Now you got to point it. Go on, point it. No. <laughs> Hell no. What if, what if, what if I gave it to him? Give it to him. Shut the f*** up. Then you, don't, you don't really want me to give it to him. Oh, little Bill tripping. I thought he was smart. What is he doing? Oh, this hey, hey, I I Ooh, I'm uncomfortable right now. I guess he don't want it, Mr. Beauchamp. I don't like none of that just happened. I give them credit though. They both smarter than I thought. Cause I just knew they was about to be like. Not me, I don't touch it no more. Oh, come on, Will, it's raining. I know it's raining. Get some of the kid, why don't you? That kid. I remember there was three men you shot, Will, not two. Well, I ain't like that no more, Ned. I ain't no crazy killing fool. Oh, he really liked that? Tell him he can loose old Bob's cuffs as soon as he's outside the county. Yep. Got my pistols. I guess you know, Bob, that uh, if I see you again, I'm just going to start shooting and figure it's self-defense. Ha! Oh, he bit the shit out that man's gun. Well, maybe if you'd cover up your face, somebody might want to hump with you. You don't have to do all that cleaning. What do you call them things you cover up your face with? A veil. Yeah, a veil. Get a veil. I mean, he just rude. Is she old enough to be there? Will? You sure? Hey, Morgan Freeman's nickname is Pure Pressure. He really trying to get that man a drink. This fella asking for you, Alice. Tonight? Must be Randy as hell to come out on this ship. <laughs> what should this put on her arms? Is that baby powder? Because <laughs> it looked like Ajax. You see them in the tavern, you know? Tramps and drunk teamsters and or men of low character. Yeah. Like your friend English Bob. Oh. You yeah, know, maybe you should just hang the carpenter. <laughs> what? Well, I, I was just saying that because of the, you know, if you hang... Doesn't matter. Hey, he took that personal. I mean, I don't blame him because he did it himself. The hell's keeping that kid? You don't suppose he's up? You know he is. Must be he's getting an advance from one of them sporting ladies. Well, um, look, if I was to, uh, I mean, if it worked out that I could take a little time for myself, I, I don't suppose you would be. I mean, you wouldn't. Do you mind if I go up here and get some booty? Hey, bro, you better start drinking that whiskey. Get warm. What's what's his wife's name? She wouldn't want you to die because you're stupid. And they be coming in there deep. Ordinance says you got to turn in your firearms to the county office, day or night. He know how. 
Spilled your whiskey. What's your name? My man ain't a drunk. What if I was to say you was a no good son of a bitch and a liar? And then if I was to say that you're shooting your pants because of a cowardly soul, but you'd show me that pistol right quick, wouldn't you? You'd shoot me dead. Isn't that so? Maybe, yeah, I guess. But the fact is I ain't carrying no firearm. Get out. So what they gonna do when they find one on them? And they's in there watching. I don't wanna be that close to a gunfight. fight. You see, Mr. Beauchamp, this is the kind of trash I can get off. You find this kind in all the saloons and all your prosperous communities. Wichita? <laughs> Oh, here's what Clint Eastwood's ass. But you won't find him in the town of Big Whiskey. What about Will? What are we going to do about Will? Come on, kid. Let's hope the horses are still there. Hey, look. When did they start making regular underwear? Because every cowboy movie I ever seen, they had that long shit on. If they was just here for the fucking how come they lit out the back window? On account they seen you was beating on their friend. They just come for the billiards, little Bill, honest. Billiards? What do you mean they're just passing through here? They was going to Far Buford. You just kicked the shit out of an innocent man. Innocent. I mean, she's not wrong. Because he hadn't done shit yet. Ah, oh, Jesus. Will. Hey, you gotta come back and f*** him up, right? His pistol must have jammed. Yeah, bring that candle in a little closer. I can't see him. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. We're gonna need more food. About three days worth. Three days? Yeah, we could kill him tomorrow. I don't kill nobody without him. We don't need him. The two of us could do it. Besides, he ain't nothing but a broken down pig farmer. See, that's that bullshit. I'm scared of dying. Oh, easy, partner. Easy. I see Claudia too. Oh, he 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 big sick. He's gonna die, ain't he? Maybe. Well, supposing he does. We'll bury him. That ain't what I mean, Ned. I don't like this little motherfucker. Well, I can't spot him myself. I thought you could see. I told you I'm a damn killer. I've done it before. I'm more of a killer than he is, anyhow. Oh, bro, you f***ing tripping. Yeah? Yeah. I can't, I'm gonna tell you, I hope something horrible happens to this. I can't wait. He's getting on my f***ing nerves. I thought you was an angel. <laughs> you ain't dead. I must look kind of like you now. The disrespect. How long have I been here? Three days. Are you hungry or? Three days. I, I ought to be. A man laid there for three days. That's a tough motherfucker right there. Them other two? Your friends? They've been taking advances on the payment. Advances? Free ones? Alice and Silky been giving them free ones. How many free ones they be getting? Would you like a free one? Well, I mean, if you done f***ed your half away, they ain't got to do my money. No, I... I guess not. I, uh, I didn't mean with me. Oh, I didn't mean I... I didn't want a free one on account of you being cut up and all. They really talk about her like she's ugly. You ain't ugly like me. It's just that we both got scars. But you're a beautiful woman, and if I was to want a, a free one, I'd want it with you, I guess, more than the mother, too. That's damn near romantic. I can't on account of my wife. Your wife? Is she back in Kansas? Yeah. Yeah, she's watching over my young one. I mean, I guess technically he ain't lying.
That had to be Ned. Better finish him, Ned. He ain't dead? You didn't get him? Got the boy's horse. Better finish him before he gets clear. Damn shame what happened to him. What happened? He ain't killed? What what's going on? Shut up! Well, I ain't very good with one of these. Oh, Morgan Freeman got saw. Keep going, baby. The rocks. Keep going. Did you get him? Will worries. Man, hey, bruh, quit asking questions. Shut up. Ned, goddammit, how many more shots do I have? Go, Davey! Better make it count. It's game time. Here, reload this. You missed him. I got him. Got him to the gut, I think. I thought he missed him. I ain't gonna lie. You think he's gonna die? Reload the gun. You think we killed him? We. Oui. You got a mouse in your pocket? I'm dying, boys! I think you shouldn't have cut up no woman, you asshole! Can we shoot him next? Slim, give me, give me some water, please. Will you give him a drink of water, for Christ's sake? We ain't gonna shoot. You ain't gonna shoot? No. I mean, we can't shoot, because both Jabber walking over here won't reload the f***ing gun. Jesus, Johnny, they shot him. No s***, bro. He told you, I'm shot. I'm dying. When are we going to double back? I have to ways. Not me. Clint Eastwood out there by himself. You want the Spencer wheel? This ain't no time to quit, Ned. You know, you're going to lose your share, Ned. Shut up. He done f***ed it away. So long, kid. Ned! Ned has got soft sauce. Uh, just doing some repairs up here. They killed one of them cowboys. This b moved in with him. Yeah, don't worry about them horses, fatty. You just get on out there to the bar T and make sure that other cowboy stays put and don't expose himself here. All right. Why are they protecting this cowboy like this? I didn't think they'd really do it. Did you think they'd come clear up from Kansas to fuck us? He had it coming! He had it coming from what he done! Oh my god. Hey, hey, I give her her props. She ain't back down out from no more in this whole movie. She talking her shit. Come across this son of a bitch on a roll heading south. Did he admit it? No, but I guess he will soon enough. Had a Spencer rifle on him. Oh, he got Ned. Oh, Ned got f***ed up. Well, I ain't worried. Because I got me some protection. That's the protection? The protection sleep. Give him any names? He didn't tell us nothing but his own name. Ned Roundtree. Uh, bring him in. You want to tell me and Mr. Uh, Beauchamp here uh, all about your two villainous friends, I guess. Are they the villains in the story? Ned in trouble, Bob. Ned tried to leave. Wound up, tied up. Oh! So hold on. Why he get the bull whip and the cowboys didn't? He can bring back stuff. You're Mr. Quincy and um, what was the young fella's name? Elroy. Elroy Tate. Is that right? Go and get them whores what fuck these boys in the night of the storm. Strawberry Alice and Silky. Yeah, go on, get. I mean, he took them whippers like a champ, though. They didn't hit me with that whoop, I'd have passed out. I'm like, ugh. Them whores are going to tell different lies than you. And when their lies ain't the same as your lies, well, I ain't going to hurt no woman. 
You slapped one earlier. The f is you talking about? Is that him? Yeah, that's him. All right, kid. Go get him. He's all yours. Damn shame what happened to this little boy. I've been mad at him this whole movie. But I know he can't kill this man. He can't see. Oh, sh Assassins! Oh! Shoot him! Pull the trigger! Pull the trigger! No, no! Pull the trigger! <laughs> oh, he did it! That was his first kill ever. He hesitated too long. People that got bodies don't hesitate. Y'all taking y'all's time. Hey, man, they about to be on y'all's ass. Shit. I thought they was going to get us. I was even scared a little. Just for a minute. Was you ever scared in them days? I can't remember. Hey, Clint East with a big motherfucker, man. Say, Will. Yeah? That was the first one. I knew it. Well, you sure killed the hell out of that fella today. He hesitated, though. I thought he was going to get killed. Take a drink, kid. You can't be an outlaw and f***ing cry! It's a hell of a thing, killing a man. You take away all he's got, and all he's ever going to have. Yeah. Well, I guess they had it coming. One more than the other. Want to help me count this stuff, kid? I trust you, Will. Well, don't go trusting me too much. In fact, we'll give Ned his share together. Ned's share? Oh, she been telling me because they don't know. He went south. We'll catch up to him. Ned, he's dead. Shut the f up. What do you mean he's dead? He went south yesterday. He ain't dead. They, they killed him. I, I thought you knew that. Nobody killed Ned. Oh, he gone, folk. The Bar T boys caught him, and Little Bill. Who killed him? L Little Bill. He was making him answer questions and beating him up, and then Ned just died. They got a sign on him, says he was a killer. They got a sign on him? In front of Greeley's. A sign on him in front of Greeley's. So they didn't hung the man up like decorations? So Little Bill killed him for what we done, huh? First, Ned wouldn't say nothing. And then little Bill heard him so bad, he said who you was. He said how you was really William Money out of Missouri, and said you was more cold-blooded than William Bonney, and how if he hurt Ned again, you was going to come kill him, like he killed a U.S. Marshal in 70. Oh. But Ned was snitching. Ned was letting him know. Ned was trying to warn him. Hey, bro, you better call some you don't want. Give me your Schofield. You go on, keep it. I'm never gonna use it again. I, I don't kill nobody no more. You kill one person, let's straight. Tell them if I ain't back in a week, they give half to Sally two trees. You keep the rest, you can get them spectacles now. You're gonna kill little Bill, ain't you? Get going. Hey man, what he about to do? Cause he got a whole bottle of whiskey in him now. Shut the f up. I, I want to say something. Alright, I'm going to say this just one more time. Shut the f up. That, that's, that's better than what I thought. They, Cause I thought they were going to have him hung. We're going to divide up into four parties. Is he in there? To make a big circle. We're bound to come across somebody who's seen these. He didn't walk up in there, did he? Oh, he got big nuts. Who's the fella who owns this shithole? Hey, bro, how you walk up into to the, to the meeting? By yourself. I, I own this establishment. Bought it from Greeley for a thousand dollars. Just hold it right there. 
Shot an unarmed man. Bruh, he in there by himself. It's 18 of y'all. You beat William Money out of Missouri. Killed women and children. That's right. And I'm here to kill you, little Bill. For what you did to Ned, you boys better move away. Oh, shut the f up. They was gone. All right, gentlemen. He's got one barrel left. When he fires that, take out your pistols and shoot him down like a mangy scoundrel he is. They are shook. Misfire. Kill us, bitch. Shut the fuck up. He hasn't moved. Any man don't want to get killed. Better clear on out the back. All right, man, shut the f up, man. And he poured himself a drink. I don't, I don't have a gun. I am not armed. Shoot him anyway. Pick up that rifle. Pick it up. Is he not worried about the people coming back around the other side? I'm not. I, I don't have a gun. I've never had a gun. I write. I'm a writer. A writer? Yeah. Hey, he switched sides a lot, too. Is that so? Yeah, Little Bill told me that. And you probably killed him first, didn't you? Little Bill ain't dead. He about to shoot you, bro. Do you see it in the mirror? Y'all see it? Hey, bro, Little Bill right there. I don't deserve this. What is it? To die like this. Bro, you whooped his ass earlier. Deserves got nothing to do with it. I'll see you in hell, William Money. I'm so nervous right now. I thought somebody was gonna come around and shoot him. All right, I'm coming out. Any man I see out there, I'm gonna kill him. Any some bitch takes a shot at me, not only gonna kill him, I'm gonna kill his wife, all his friends, burn his damn house down. Oh, Clint East with all that bullshit. Talk your shit. Yeah. I don't know. I ain't no deputy. <laughs> come back and kill every one of you sons of bitches. My man said, bury my homeboy. You better not touch no horse. I'm killing everything moving. Is anybody going to try him? He for real just leaves down? Nobody tries this man? Shut the f up. And he about died three days ago. Three, four days ago. Oh, I didn't know he directed this too. William Money. My man got King Kong next. All right. 
<laughs> we just got finished watching Unforgiven. And um, Clint East was a bad man. That's a bad man. My man spent 85% of the movie talking about I ain't like how I was. I don't drink. My wife, he don't got me away from that. You know what I'm saying? I don't do that no more. We're just going to go kill these people because I got to get this money. You know what I'm saying? For the kids or whatever. They done some bad stuff to a woman. Old girl pulled up on the horse. She was like, Nan's dead. A word? Tell me about it. And I know people in real life that when they drink, they like to fight. But let me tell you, if I drunk and turn to Clint Eastwood in this movie, hey, you talking about a meme? Bruh. Listen, my man walked in a, what, a council meeting. A town council meeting. What? Let me tell you the kind of minutes this motherfucker would have been if he had a bottle of whiskey. A whole bottle of whiskey? Can you imagine he was on some tequila? Imagine he was on that Patron. That's a bad motherfucker, boy. And he did this off of fever. He just come off of fever. And I know I wanted the little boy to die the whole movie. But he got okay at the end because he shot somebody and was like, you know what? This ain't for me. Here, take all my stuff. I don't even want no money. And he was Clint Eastwood's only friend. If man would have lived, I probably still would have wished death on him. But Clint Eastwood only had one friend left. If you get sick and get better, you don't go right back outside. You take an extra day or two. This motherfucker just... And he passed his prom. He, oh my God, he's past his prom. He's old as fuck. He been out the game 11 years. He did all this off of 11 year retirement. Clint Eastwood, you robbed us, bro. We need, we need to see this man's prom. Rob, we didn't see him in his prom, baby. But I hope y'all enjoyed watching this with me because I enjoyed watching with y'all. If you didn't do it for me earlier, please do it for me now. Hit the like, comment, and subscribe for me. You know what I'm saying? Don't forget to check out the Patreon. Speaking of Patreon, I got some um shout outs I need to do. I'm doing them now. I'm doing them now. I'm gonna shout out to Leslie, Trey, John Harold, Becca June, the beautiful dog Missy, Big Al Robin, John the Patrick, Simon X, Lost Opportunity, Cody Stoudemire, Frost 1997, Paul Swicky, Grady B. Olson. Adam, Anna Rondo, Big Frank, Echo, Naran, TJ Gingler, Kevin Riley, Red Tail Z, Thomas E. Johnson Jr., The Brandons, Garrett, Nicholas Jenkins, Jennifer and Natalie, Christmas William Ball, David Gibson, BB98, David King, Hope Movies at Midnight. I want to thank all y'all for being VIPs. I want to thank everybody else for being part of the family as well. Y'all the best part of the channel. We thank y'all for all the love and support I give. Um, to all the new people, welcome to the family. Hope you enjoyed everything that we're doing. I probably need to take them O-U-T. I'm going to test it out and see. You need to go potty? Let's see that. Let's see. <laughs> I'm coming. Y'all be good. Y'all be safe. Night, night. You going to tell night, night? Good boy.